So I got this um, Kat Von D Shade and Light Brush. I got the Shade and Light Palette as well. And I got this is, um, matte translucent powder, smooth focus pressed setting powder shine control by Laura Mercier. I think that's how you say it. It's really white, but it's not that scary on the skin. <laughs> I promise. And I got this Silk Cream Oil Free Photo Edition Foundation. So this is fragrance free. And it's good if you have like any skin problems like eczema or something. Um just because fragrance in your products will irritate the skin. So this does have, I think this has fragrance in it, but oh well. The, these are like the shade names in it. And... I can already tell you guys now that these two are going to be my favourite, these four. So I probably won't be just using them two. And I heard a Kat Von D is um, making refills for this palette as well. So that would be cool. If she did. Okay. Look what came today. My Mecca Maxima. Their packaging is always like spot on. I've been waiting for this for like ages. It only just came to Australia. So that's why I'm only getting it now. <laughs> This is like my first ever Too Faced palette and wow, it actually really smells like chocolate, that's amazing. Mm -hmm. I had no idea that it would actually smell like chocolate. <laughs>
happy so I can't wait to use this already I can just tell how many cotton candy this one's called that looks like it'll be a good shade not sure if I will be using this shade it's called Earl Grey but I'm not sure I might Pecan, Dark Truffle, Cashew Chew, Almond Truffle, Satin Sheet Sprinkle, Molasses Chip, I think that's how you say it, might be saying that wrong, Malted Black Currant Mocha, um, not sure how to say that one. <laughs> um, I'm not sure how to say the rest either. <laughs> They've got weird names. Oh my god. So this will go in my eye drawer. Okay, so... Um, not sure if I showed you guys already, but I also got the Cap Von D Shade and Light Palette too. Hey everyone, so, um, I just like basically finished work and, well, I got undressed first and like into more comfy clothes. Um, so, I'm just sitting in my room and trying to decide what to do with this pile of clothes. As you can see, <laughs> I need to do something with it because it's just in the way of everything. So, like, this turtleneck I spent like $80 on. But I don't want it anymore and I don't have a closet space for any of these clothes and I've spent like a fortune on most of it so I'm not sure maybe I'll try sell it on eBay or something and if you guys are like interested in any of the clothes maybe and figure something out and get it to you guys um but yeah I'm not sure if it'll fit anyone <laughs> because I'm um, it's really big clothing <laughs> like size 14 I am in that that's Australia I'm not sure if that same sizing in America my lips are so dry and sore Today is meant to get up to 40 degrees, so that's really hot here in Australia, if you're wondering. <laughs> um, yeah, I was about to film, like, stuff that I would regret buying, that I regret buying and stuff. Um, so yeah, here's a sneak peek, but my camera got too hot, so... I couldn't film it. <laughs> Stupid camera. But it would have been up today if I could have filmed it. But I couldn't. So I'm sorry. There's no video because it's too hot and my camera's too hot. I couldn't handle the heat. Um. So I've got new things. So I'll show you them. 